Got more bass than Chris Kringle. Santa. Puffin' on the slip of a winker. Get down if you run up. I'm from the town where niggas get down from sundown to sun up. Believe all of what you see and 50% of what you hear on what you hear on. When you win a box, I can make up. I stay so a niggas took my position. My position. Pressure bust on it. It's bigger than you. Listen. Fuck it, rich at the lottery. The top commodity. Blood on my wallabies for Robin's bread. Each one of these niggas have a gun with my name on it. You know. <laughs> niggas out there wanna do me. But it's my dude. Bad boy of the Fuji's. Ha 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 ha. Yo, yo, welcome and thanks for joining. Once again, it's your boy FACE, feet on the ground, ears to the street, coming at you with another Bass Star exclusive. Now, this video right here is in response to the alleged news that the OVO fighter jet banged down Rick Ross's private jet as they was in the sky. You know what I'm saying? Now, we're going to say allegedly because there's reports from the Young Turks. <clears throat> there's reports from the Federal Aviation Commission, and then there's also reports from the General News, and some of these reports are conflicting, you know what I'm saying? So uh, I'm going to just give you the rundown real quick, you know what I'm saying? Rick Ross got on his social media and said that his jet was shot down, you know what I'm saying? And that immediately went viral, you know what I'm saying? Now, the Young Turks did a report, you know, co-telling what Rick Ross said, but the Federal Aviation Commission got a report and also Black Twitter saying that his plane was just stuck in the grass, you know what I'm saying? And he took the story and ran with it. So uh, I'm gonna let y'all decide for yourself. Once again, this your boy F-A-C-E, feet on the ground, ears to the street, coming at you with another Bay Star exclusive. Um, Rick Ross said that Drake, in in his jet shot down Rick Ross's jet. And when Rick Ross said this, the FAA, the Federal Aviation um, Administration had to get involved. This is getting serious. So let me do this. I'm going to go to the video first and then give you the background. Here it is. So thank you everybody for all the prayers, but I'm gonna tell you, we on the jet and I'm seeing the fighter jet. I see his nose, it's like Tom Cruise from um, Top Gun. I seen his nose, I'm seeing him in the cockpit. And I'm like, damn, I see his cheeks and nose going back from the G-Force. I'm like, damn. And then, hey man, it happened, you know what I'm saying? I can't say what happened, but it happened. Well, he kind of did say what happened. And so let's put it up full mass here. All right, this thing gets real deep, everybody. All right, so Rick Ross claims Drake had his plane shot down. Uh, a private jet carrying Ricky Rose was involved in an incident in Dallas, Texas. And the rapper swiftly took to social media to claim Drake was behind the unfortunate event. However, Ross's story didn't quite align with the reports from the Federal Aviation Administration. Ross arrived in Arlington, Texas aboard his private jet Thursday, May 2nd, before his scheduled performance at the Garden Restaurant and Bar in Dallas later that evening. The following day, images of Rick Ross branded aircraft stuck in the grass near the runway hit social media and immediately went viral. Ross played into the plane crash hysteria, taken to his Instagram stories to reshare the images of his grounded jet with the caption stating, my jet crash, Drake OVO F-16 fighter jet just shot us down. 